Welcome back to the FlipNerd.com REI Classroom, where experts from across the real estate investing industry teach you quick lessons to take your business to the next level. And now, let's meet today's expert host. This is uh, Steve Bigass with Guaranteed Rate, host of the REI Classroom. Uh, welcome everybody here. So what we're going to do is we're going to discuss briefly now some of the changes with, uh, with Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac that have transpired over the last year. This REI Classroom Real Estate Lesson is sponsored by TheInvestorMachine.com, FlipNerd's private investor coaching program and your blueprint to investing success. Um, some of the uh, larger changes was uh, last year was uh, Freddie Mac went ahead and opened up their uh, number of finance properties from four to six. Uh, so that was, a, you know, that was a pretty good move. Uh, Fannie Mae realigned their policy on multiple finance properties. Um, as as so, some of you may not be aware of that, Fannie Mae allows up to 10 finance properties. Their uh, previous uh, guideline on multiple finance properties, they set the threshold at one to four, five through 10. And uh, basically what happened is that, that one to four determined, you know, like credit scores, down payment, uh, reserve types. And then when you went to five to 10, that changed a little bit. Now what they've done in that is they uh, moved, their, moved the multiple finance guidelines from one to six and seven through 10. Now, where that differs a little bit is, and the big difference is when you move to property seven through 10, you've got to have a 720 credit score. And, and so that's, that is huge. The, also the reserve requirements changed. Now, Fannie Mae did change their reserve requirements. They went to an aggregate reserve requirement. So previously before it was on properties one to four, you had to have six months on a subject property and two months on each additional investment property or second home. And then on five to 10, it was six months on each investment property or uh, secondary home. Now, primary residence was never included in that calculation. Now what they've done is they've went to an aggregate adjustment where they go one to four finance properties. It's 2% of the outstanding principal balance. Properties five and six, it's 4%, and seven through 10, it's 6%. So it's a little bit of a difference. In some cases, a reserve requirement is going to go up a little bit. Some cases it's going to be the same. Some cases it's going to go down. It just all depends on what those balances are. Now, there was, you know, when it first came out, everybody was was concerned about it. Um, you know, I look at it. I mean, the, the industry is going to continually change. I mean, it's just going to happen, and we have to adjust the changes. And we need to understand why they do some of the changes. Uh, you know, there's still the... Uh, um, consensus that investment property is a little bit riskier. They want to make sure that, that as an investor that you do have adequate reserves because let's face it, things happen on properties. You know, water heaters break, you know, you have to replace the roof. So the last thing in the world they want to do is put somebody in, you know, have somebody buy an investment property that doesn't have adequate cash to, you know, to be able to take care of those, this, those items. And that is, probably, you know, that's a, you know, just another concern uh, as far as failure. And the last thing we want to do is we want to have anybody fail on their investment property financing. You know, as far as that goes, I mean, and oh, another big thing too, and that is that with that uh, multiple finance properties, I talked earlier about the one to four, five through 10 on the previous one. Well, that determined as far as down payment. So one to four, you could do 20% down on your first four finance properties. And then and then five through 10, you had to put 25% down. So that's been done away with. So you can do uh, one to 10 single families, you can do 20% down. And then on two to four units, that's 25. So that was a pretty big change. Uh, allows people to uh, um, you know, maximize their dollars a little bit more, maybe potentially buy some more properties. So, so again, they're positive changes. Um, you know, within the industry and that they will continue to evolve. So I'm sure like anything and that, they'll, you know, there'll be more changes that will come down the line, whether they're good or bad. You know, we don't know. Um, we'll just have to adjust, ad adapt to them as they come down. So good. I hope everybody enjoyed the topic and uh, take care. Bye bye. Are you looking to change your life through real estate investing? If you're interested in either getting started or taking your business to the next level, please check out FlipNerd's private program at theinvestormachine.com. This is the most robust real estate investor coaching, networking, and mastermind on the planet and designed for your success. If you're ready to roll up your sleeves, ready to take personal responsibility for your own success, and ready to dive into a world-class instructional coaching program that provides you step-by-step -step instruction to help you achieve financial freedom, then you should apply today. 
Spaces are limited and candidates are only considered after an application and interview process. Our 12-month investor program is unparalleled. Think you might be a fit? Learn more today at theinvestormachine.com. Please note, the views and opinions expressed by the individuals in this program do not necessarily reflect those of Flipnerd.com or any of its partners, advertisers, or affiliates. Please consult professionals before making any investment or tax decisions, as real estate investing can be risky. Are you a member yet of Flipnerd.com, the hottest real estate investing social community online? If not, you can join for free in less than 30 seconds and get access to hundreds of off-market deals, vendors in your market to help you in your business. And you can start networking with thousands of other investors just like you. Get your free account now at FlipNerd.com. Please check out the FlipNerd family of real estate investing shows, where you can access hundreds of expert interviews, quick tips, and lessons from leaders across the real estate investing industry. They're available at FlipNerd.com slash shows, or simply search for FlipNerd in the iTunes store.